I'm Dan Helwig. I'm the laboratory director for Sorensen Forensics, a private DNA testing laboratory. I've been in DNA uh, in some way, shape, or form for 12 years. Forensic DNA has moved in light speed in the last 20 years. We are able to detect and get DNA profiles from much smaller uh, amounts of DNA in the past decade than we have ever in my time in forensic DNA. The ability to obtain more DNA is essential to developing a DNA profile. The more DNA we can get, the better and more easily we are able to interpret the DNA that we obtain and develop those DNA profiles that we work with. The problem is collection has not moved. We're, we're basically using the same technology we did 20 years ago today. The MBAC gives us a technology increase in the collection of that DNA evidence because the, the samples that we're dealing with can be so small and, and still develop a DNA profile. This powerful tool that we're getting in the MBAC is a collection device that has allowed us to get past these kind of obsolete methods of collection and it is something that gives us a more powerful tool that we can use to employ on certain evidence types. The place to employ the MVAC most dramatically is in samples that aren't conducive to swabbing. Swabbing is the, the gold standard, if you will, of collection of DNA evidence. We would use an MVAC in cases where swabbing just doesn't pick up the type of material that, that uh, we're looking for. Surfaces that are, that are porous, that are fabric oriented, and even to other type of porous surfaces such as rocks and bricks. Places where the skin cells, the DNA itself, can get stuck in the nooks and crannies of, of the material and need that, that higher technology system of collection are places where we would take that powerful MVAC tool and employ it for collection to pull it out and get it available for DNA processing rather than swabbing. There's literally no difference in how we process the sample that comes off of the MVAC versus what we would use in, in swabbing itself. Without the MVAC tool in our toolbox, we certainly wouldn't have had the ability to obtain these DNA profiles that were pivotal to solving cases that have come through our lab.